no intro today because for this video because this is the type of thing that you can't really form an introduction to or at least I can't and this is going to be more of a venting type of video because we are of course doing a review of season four episode three of fear the walking dead and this will contain major spoilers a very big character dies in this episode and if you don't want to be spoiled get off the video so I'll try to handle everything before it first this is a good episode uh, I think it was it, it had decent pacing I liked what happened in it. I liked the interactions between Morgan and Nick. I liked how they developed Althea a little bit more into kind of a overall just good person. <sighs> you can't avoid... I'm, I'm just... I'm in utter shock. It's... I can't really put into words. Spoiler alert. Five, four, three, two, one. They killed off Nick. Oh... And I can't help but just look at AMC and see that they're trying to get fear off the ground more. Their ratings for season one was okay. Season two they dropped. Season three they dropped even more. And then season four came around. They bumped up a little bit of ratings. They went so far as to take a major character from the original series and bring him over to fear, that being Morgan. And now... I'm just looking at AMC like, what the hell are you doing? This is a bombshell. This is... I have a lot of questions for where it goes from here, and I'm legitimately fearful for fear because, as I said in my quick reaction video, because how are they going to handle this? How are they going to come back from this? Nick was the Daryl of this show, and... I don't want to sit and ramble on for 15 minutes about how wrong the death is because I feel like most people that watch this are going to feel the same way because most people like Nick. And like I said, for the rest of, rest of the episode is fine. I think that they, what they did with the rest of the characters was neat. I, I mean, I like the interaction between Luciana and John Dory. I think that was interesting for both of them and I, maybe they'll form a friendship but because John just seems like a good guy. But it's, it's hard to focus on anything else in the episode because it's literally as if you had this decent episode in Walking Dead and then they ended up killing Daryl in the last two minutes. You're not going to be able to focus on the episode. You're only going to be able to focus on this. And this is something where I would love to hear your guys' thoughts of this. This is huge. This is a major, major event. Uh, spoilers for the original Walking Dead. My favorite character from The Walking Dead was Glenn, and when he died, I was less affected than I am from Nick's death. And I am without words that can describe just how I'm feeling. And I would love to hear you guys' thoughts. So this has been Jay Morse Review Guy. Uh, I'm signing off, saying farewell. Farewell.